so I'd like to welcome you to the monastery of Celanova. We're in the northwest corner of Spain and I've come here to play some Baroque music by Bach. Before I play some music, I'd like to show you around this magnificent and historic building. The tiny medieval chapel still stands in the monastery gardens. The front of the monastery gives on to the main square of the town. Nowadays the building holds the local council, a high school and the parish church. A striking baroque altarpiece with two sumptuous Solomonic columns and numerous glittering ornamentations dominate the church. This beautiful church has two wonderful choirs, the Gothic upper choir beside the organ decorated with many curious images, among them this Piper monk. The lower choir is Baroque and it's adorned with images of Benedictine saints.
We're in the Baroque cloister, which maintains the medieval Gothic arches. The original constructions date from the 10th century. So we're now in the cloister of the monastery of Thelanova. And there go the bells, telling us the time every quarter of an hour. This building has gone through many different transformations. Now, this is a high school and the kids get to study in a wonderful historic surrounding. This is the back entrance to the monastery, which is mainly used by the school now. But this area is also very popular to the local people who enjoy sitting under the trees on a warm day. I am now in the Poleiro. The Poleiro is a balcony which runs completely around the cloister. Poleiro means more or less a chicken run. And the name comes from the fact that the young monks had their rooms all the way around the cloister. And they were of course the young chickens. This elegant three section staircase was built as the main access to the new cloister at the beginning of the 17th century. The date 1607 can still be seen on the keystone of its vault. Several of the windows have stone seats built into either side called faladoiros, which means places to talk. 